Okay, um, I'm seeing three bands that I've been waiting to see for years, uh, tonight, and that is Plain White Tees, Daughtry, and the Goo Goo Dolls. So, I'm pretty, 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 pretty flippin' excited right now. So, um, ooh. Yeah, my gas doesn't look so great. Okay, well, anyways, I'm gonna make it. I will see you guys at the venue. All right, bye. This is really, really weird to me because this is my first time going to a show at Jexa, but not being Warped Tour. I'm standing where Warped Tour usually happens. I'm just so used to, because the amphitheater they always use for the stages, and then they have the main stages out here, and a few other things, so. I don't know, it's just it's just a new kind of thing. Uh, I'm not sure if I want to do lawn because it rained all day today, just about. So I don't think we're going to be doing lawn. Uh, I guess I'll sit underneath because, I mean, it's my first time seeing Daughtry. I've been seven years. I've been waiting to see him. And people are just popping beer. <laughs> this is going to be an interesting show to watch. Uh, I'm really, I, I'm really, like, genuinely excited. I know my voice might not inflect it. Yeah, see, like, right down here. Okay, right down here. This is like, um, okay, Monster Stage is usually over here. They have tents set up over here. Let's see, I'm, this, this is, this is what's happening to me. <laughs> is that I just, I'm so used to all of this being warped to her. And, and that's just the damnedest thing. <laughs> that I've just been out here so many times. Yeah, because Monster Stage is usually out this way. Kevin says is usually right over here. Main stages are out back that way where I parked. And... I don't know, tonight's just gonna be a bombastic time, and I'm just really excited to finally get to see one of, I, I gotta say, one of my favorite bands, and one of the reasons why I started playing guitar. Uh, so this is rad. Alright, well, I gonna need to go buy my ticket, and I will see you guys in a bit. Sit in the middle section, uh, it's only 55 bucks, surprisingly, which is still really stinking good for waiting all these years to see Daughtry and Goo Goo Dolls and Plain White Tees and I think they go on in like 10 minutes or maybe less, I'm not sure. They don't even have, they have friggin' seats in the pit. This is so weird. This is like completely new to me. I'm so used to it being just open like with Warped Tour and everything and even Fall Out Boy is going to be like the exact same way. I'm so used to it having like a barricade and everything. Daughtry, I'm so excited! Last row, well, oh, hey. Alright, excuse me, pardon me, come to so, this is going to be my view all night, which I'm pretty damn excited for. Uh, I think Plain White Tees go on about 10 minutes or so, so I'll get a little clips and stuff of them. Uh, I'm going to use my other camera for that, and I'll see you guys on the other side of the show. Hey there, Delilah, you be good. Don't you miss me two more years and you'll be done with school. I'll be making history like I do. Hey, Dallas, Texas, here's to you. Woo! I'm in seats and uh, during Plain White Tees, now during Plain White Tees they're kind of a kind of more uh, mellow, melodic band, but if people don't start standing up and stuff during Daughtry, this is like going to turn into a really awkward show really, really fast, because I'm used to standing up the entire show and not sitting down for one bit, unless it's Warped Tour, and even Warped Tour, I'm usually not sitting down at all, I'm usually like just um, standing up the whole time, but, but hey. I get to see some of my favorite bands tonight, so I'm not complaining too, too much. There's so many people, and the food, of course, because it's Jexa, is super extra expensive, but I think that's with any concert venue. I think they're just about set up for Joshi. I'm not sure what time exactly they go on, but they're going on stage. I know, I, I can feel it in my soul. In my soul.
guys, so, uh, Dachi just got off the stage, they're setting up for the Goo Goo Dolls right now, and look what the fuck I got. I'm fucking, you don't understand, I'm freaking out right now. What's your name? This is Ashley, guys. I made a friend. Her boyfriend's sitting over here. I think he's cool with it. Uh, so during the plane YG, everybody was sitting down, and I'm not used to sitting down at concerts at all, so it was really awkward. So I was like, it's a freaking concert, why not stand up? So we both were standing up the whole time during plane YG, so that was really awesome. So high five on that. Dachi was incredible. It was so much more than what I ever dreamed of, like, ever, like, ever seeing it, so. Uh, I met some twins. This is, this is freaking awesome. Kelly. Joanne. Nice to meet you. You guys are such sweethearts. Thank you so much. Here, you guys want to hug? Alright, so this is this is turning out to be a really, really fun night. It's gotten a lot better because uh, I just kind of gotten past the whole awkwardness of like having a seat, but I still had a really sick good time. And I got Dr. Yeah, I'm still I'm still freaking out about it, but uh, I'm excited for the Goo Dolls. I know, the only song I know is Iris. I know, cliche and Goo Goo Dolls. I don't claim to be an avid Goo Goo Dolls fan, however, uh, I love to be opening new music and bands that I haven't seen before. What's up guys, so I made a friend, uh, wait, what's your name one more time, dude? Jill. Jill, her name is Jill, and uh, she's going to be getting me, uh, literally, like, front row, right? Front row, baby. Even right now, I'm just speechless. Daughtry was incredible. Uh, Goo Goo Dolls were like insane. Like I don't even know. Uh, I got one of their set lists, and that's probably the coolest thing that's ever happened to me. Like this is, oh, I, I can't, I can't even put it into words. Uh, it's probably the weirdest vlog of. Okay, so I'm gonna try to go by the buses, but. Um, 
this is a little tougher than Warp Tour because I'm not parked over here. But I, I, I know how this whole thing works. And I don't know how Jex is about these one-time shows and stuff. So that's why I'm kind of trying to keep my cool and whatnot and act like I know what I'm doing. But I would seriously kill to meet like Dr. Ian and all the rest of those guys. Uh, or even somebody from Plain White Tees. Uh, I doubt I'm going to meet the Google Dolls. But it just would be the fucking bombastic thing to meet any of them. So uh, I'm going to see what I can do. But I just don't want to get kicked out. That's the only thing. It's really the last thing I want. Is to be banned from Jexa for trying to meet band members. Um, so, I'm watching what these people are doing. And I'm going to stay on the good side of the fence with the other peoples. And we'll see what happens. So, I'm not even pointing at myself. Okay. Um, Let's see how this goes down. All right, bye guys. So I just met Chris Daughtry, and I'm like, he's still over here. He's over here. I'll get him to say hi in a minute, but he's taking pictures of other people. I don't want to be rude, but um, this is like a dream come true. This whole night just. This entire year has just been incredible, and I, I just, I, I really don't know how to put it. This guy's just like laughing at me. He's like, he is, oh, hey, he's, hey, <laughs> it's not that guy, great. Me, me, Chris. It's not that great. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's the Chris Daughtry. <laughs> um, I'm just speechless right now. I've, I've, looked, always, I've looked up to this guy for years, and to finally meet him is really, really humbling. And so, um, He's influenced a lot of songs that I've written, and just the way I write, and just the musician that I am today, and the person that I am too. So, um, yeah. Uh, I'm just gonna call it a night unless somebody else comes out. Which, at this rate, uh, I don't know. But um, see you guys. Soon.